Vito, I'll see you soon. All right, buddy. I'll see you soon, Harry. Thanks for the gifts. Appreciate you, fam. You see, I like this. I came here looking for a gun. And this man here, this man gives me a nice gun and some ammo. Just because. I like that. Nice, look at that. Now, didn't he say there's like more ammo? Yeah, who is it? It's me, Vito. Yeah. Could have sworn he says I can take some ammo here. Or not. No? Yo. You said I can take some ammo, right? Hold on. Look at that. Okay, so I guess when he offered to take some ammo. Oh, hey, wait. Don't forget the ammo, too, huh? Hell yeah. Let me see a magnum, a shotgun. Whew. Uh, that's it? Here you go. Don't hurt yourself. Oh, trust like me, I'm my good. My mom always said you can never have too much ammo. Thanks, man. I appreciate the gun and the ammo. Man. You're turning into my number one customer. Ha, <laughs> you funny. I'll see you soon, Harry. Man, I got a nice piece. I'm excited. Hopefully, I'm not gonna use it anytime soon. But, you know, if I have to, I have to. You feel me? Radio off. Thank you. Lover of ladies here, like my video, share my video. Leave your comments below because I just love talking to you guys, but most importantly, subscribe to my channel. That way you'll be able to get daily gaming content from me and hit that notification button as well so you know when I upload my videos. Sorry lady, didn't mean to try and run you over. You were just in the way, that's all. Okay, so with the type of gun that Harry gave me, we're really about to blow things up. And look at me sliding because, you know, I can't drive, apparently. But yeah, we're really about to kabloom whatever place we're going to be in. So, my thoughts on Mafia 2. So far, I do like the story. Vio, uh, sorry, Vino. He's, I mean... He's obviously no Tommy. I miss Tommy. But I, I feel like I can't really judge him so far. I mean, I know this is like episode 5. But I just... I feel like I still need to get to know this character. Yeah, he is definitely trying to help his sister and his mom out. Which, by the way props to him he doesn't have to he doesn't have to do that i mean he just came back from war technically he has every right to just simply live his life and forget about his past including his father's death but this man here he, i can tell he is such a family man because he cares a lot about his mom and his sister that he's willing to help them pay his father's debt which pretty honorable in my books but he low-key doesn't have to. Number two, I just feel like... Yeah, he was a troublemaker from the start. But he was just... He just needs to be in the right direction. Unfortunately, as soon as he got back from the States... He went back to being in the wrong direction. Once he ends up being with his friend. I understand he wants to make a life. He wants to make money. I understand that, you know, these regular 9-to-5 jobs ain't cutting it. But you just gotta be careful. You gotta be careful with what you're doing. Because at this point, you don't want to end up being like Tommy, getting killed, you know? Alright, we're here.
Yo, you mad loud, wake up. Where are you from, Henry? Sicily. What brought you to the States? Mussolini. Mm, we buy your ticket. Don't be a smart ass, Joe. My father was a... Uh, a man of honor. And things got pretty bad for us after Mussolini came into power. My old man figured I'd either get drafted or locked up. So, he sent me to America and got me a job working for Pimenti. Wow. As if he didn't really have any choice. That's sad. So what happened to your father? He said he was too old to make the trip. Mussolini had him arrested, and he died in jail. Wow. They won't even turn his body over for a proper burial. Oh, that is so disrespectful. So how's your English so good? They're coming. Those black cars. Vito, aim for the fat bastard. We gotta nail him before he gets in the building. Get ready. All right, I'm on. Those two guys Showtime. out in the Showtime. outside don't even know what they got themselves into. Bye! Let's go! Woohoo! Nice! Folded like an omelet, baby! Alright, come on. Ooh! Okay, so she's the fat man. Say less. Alright, let's go. I gotta go. I got I got a fat man to chase. Oh snap! We got people trying to get down, get in here now. All right, hold on. I could have sworn I bought a gun. Okay, nice. All right, let's go. I got chase the fat man. I'll be right back. Bye. Ooh, ooh. Oh, oh no. Oh no, I'm about to die. How am I alive? Oh, I'm dead. Okay, thanks. Got it. Wee, wee. Where's Fat Man? All right, let me chase Fat Man. Let me get my gun, though. All right, I'm ready. Damn, that was a really big fail. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, 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 okay, I see you. Okay, thanks. Come on. I'm taking my time, too. Oh, this magazine. Oh, snap. Okay, are we good? Is there another one here? I see someone. Oh, is he dead? Come on. Damn, I really can't Let shoot straight. You can't let that fat bastard get away. I know, I know, I'm trying. I'm okay, just, you know, first, Vito, I don't want to die. War hero. Go, go, we'll cover you. War hero? Okay. Coming for you, Porky. Oh, oh, snap, someone's shooting. Someone's shooting. Ooh, right in the shoulder. Oh. Come on. Thank you. Yo, it's a good thing I bought this gun. Okay, he's the good guy. I mean, he's my... He's my teammate. Come here. Ooh, that gun went through the wall? Get out. Oh, the place is on fire. Nice. Ooh. What do you want me to do? Okay, we got this. Hello? Ooh. Muy caliente. Come here. Come on. Oh, shit. Ooh. So, I'm eating bullets, but I'm still alive, so I'm surprised. Who the hell is that? Right in the nuts. Let's go. There you go. There you go. How can I reload? Or can I reload? Uh-huh. Wait, take what? Magazine? Oh, this is a cute one. Thank you. Alright, let's go. Come on. 
I just need to reload, sorry. Oh! Bingo! Oh, no. No. What is that? Right, Vito, oh, God. Oh, God, no. So many people. Boom, baby. I'm taking my sweet time. Alright, we good? Fat man's over there, right? Hold on. I'm taking my sweet time. Are you the bad guy? No. Well, technically, Stop. we're all bad guys, but... Excuse me? Don't tell me what to do! Boom. Boom. Oh, shit. Ooh, right in the face. All right, so what? We go up here? Okay, Is that it? Hit the button, Vito. Wait, let me get a shotgun. Thank you. Hell yeah. All right, what button might... Okay, right here. I'm ready. Okay, so I got a shotgun for free, and I got this. What are you doing, Joe? What do you mean? Thirsty. Pretty good stuff. You should try it. No, I'm good. You can keep it. Drinking on the job, huh? When'd you turn Irish? Look at him, he's judging him because he's drinking the bottle. I mean, same, we gotta concentrate, so. Hello? Oh! Oh! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh! Yo, I almost got shot. I'll come down! I got this! I got this! You ready? Where they at? Where they at? Oh shit. Oh shit. Ooh. Oh, I'm dying. Okay. Let me stand still. We're over here. Okay, I'm good. I somehow healed. Where you at? Oh shit. Right in the nuts. Let's go. Alright, are we good? Woo! No, yeah, we good. We good. Okay, so where is the others? Porky. Oh, yeah. The guy that we need to get. Fat man. Ah! You know what? Cut it out. Thank you. Alright, let me stay here for a bit. Let me recover my health, you know? Am I good? Oh, I could have done that the whole time. Wow, that's cute. Anyways, let's go. I'm ready. You're gonna run out of ammo, so I'm just waiting. Where you at? Where you at, fool? Hi, how you doing? That's why your ass is toast. Dead. <laughs> so you're fat, man. Don't kill me. Please. I got you should have thought about your wife before. Shoot him. Don Clemente sends his regards. Wow, oh. no. Fuck! <coughs> what? He shot him? Oh, fuck you, oh, sorry you... <clears throat> there you go! Eat them, eat them bullets, fat man! Eat them bullets! Hey, Henry, you okay? Where'd he hit? Of I'm not fucking okay! He shot me in the fucking leg! <clears throat> okay, it's the leg, though. Oh, yeah. It's the leg. Son of a... <clears throat> Get me to El Greco! The fucking painter? No, the fucking doctor, okay, you idiot. Get easy. We're gonna get you there in a minute. The Greek guy lives up in Highbrook. Right, let's get you to the oh, car. Oh, Marana, you're heavier than you look. The judgment's real. All this right, let's fuck. go. You almost shot my balls off. Bendito. Take it easy, Mr. Mile. Bendito. Oh, I got this? Hey. Oh, I'm using this gun. Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Come on, Vito! He's bleeding all over the place! Move it! Bro! I'm moving, come on! Are you, like... Why are you so far behind? Oh, hey, shit. Careful. Please, I don't want yeah, to well, you can Okay, walk, you get out. Get out! Hey, I don't need to get pissed. What the hell?! Oh, what the hell is this?! Are you guys okay?! Oh, oh shit! The place is coming apart. Okay, come on, let's go. Let's skedaddle, cause this is not it. Oh shit, this is hor- Oh shit. Anyways. Oh shit, oh shit. This is horrible. Okay, 
Let me let me take a break for a little bit. Okay, good. All right, come on, let's go. Let's go. That's what I'm trying to do. Excuse me. Are you done, asshole? Trying to kill me? Trying to kill me? Jerk. Are you coming or not? Okay. All right. This Damn it, I know it. building is burning. Are you good? Are you even behind me? Oh, damn, you are. But then again, he's carrying an actual man, so of course he's going to be behind a little bit. All right, come on. Shit! Beetle, find a way out! I'm trying. <coughs> oh, damn smoke. Damn, this is crazy. Ooh, okay. I'm trying. Right over here. Come on. Come on, out here. Come on. Dead ass. Y'all taking so long. Please, come on. Come on, let's go. We gotta go before the cops get here and seize us. I don't want to get caught, you know? Ah, oh, fuck. No, no. No, I no. Come on. Al, it's just a scratch. The doc will give you a few stitches, and then we'll all go out and celebrate. No, really. Shh. You should talk right now. Helps conserve your strength. I seen that in a movie once. Yeah. And what happened to the guy in the movie? He died. Nah. Jesus, you drive like my fucking grandmother. Oh, snap. Oh snap, let's go. Oh wow, this jerk! This jerk! Oh gosh, this man is gonna die. I can tell he's gonna die. Alright, I got this. I got this. Just hold on tight. I thought we were able to get away easy, but I guess not. And this car is taking all a long damage. This man's gonna die. I can feel it. Henry like a whore in back here. I'm trying! The pressure is getting worse. Okay, so the cops are not on our tail anymore, which is great. But the thing is, ooh. Woo! Ooh, ooh, I'm trying not to crash. This man's dying, I can tell. Because look, look at the clock. And the music's not even helping either. Wow, we are really wanted. But dude, they th how? Great, now the car is wanted by the cops. It's hey, bad enough. Can't this thing go any faster? Bro, as fast as I'm can, chill. Well, I'm trying. Oh, relax, shit, oh shit, oh shit. Would you? Oh shit, oh shit. I got a hole in my leg the size of a fucking golf ball and you're telling me to relax? Yes, Just because right. Go, I'm trying. On, Vito, at this rate, we get there faster if we walk. Yeah, whatever. Just shut your pie holes, bro. I'm trying, okay? Hey, We're almost there. Who is this guy? What guy? This guy is taking Henry. El Greco? He's a doctor. Throw him a couple of bucks, he patches you up. No questions asked. He's the guy you go see when you can't go to the hospital, genius. Why the hell wouldn't you be able to go to the hospital? Because you go to the hospital with a bullet in you, first thing they do is call the cops. Yeah. So El Greco deals with a lot of guys in our line of work. You shouldn't need to visit him, though, Vito. You've always been a quick healer. Must be your diet. I'm trying not to crash, but yeah. Oh, gosh. Okay. Uh, excuse me. Hey, Thank you. Henry's done for. If he dies, you're burying him. Oh, fuck. Yeah, oh, fuck. Wait. Stay with me now. Yeah. Just hang in there, pal. We'll be at El Greco's in a minute. I can We're right the there. Oh, me. gosh. We're not right there. That's cool. So, where's this Greco guy? I hope... Yo, I don't even have... You know what? I'm gonna be really optimistic here. We have plenty enough time. He's not gonna die. And everything would be good and dandy. That's it. Okay? Good and dandy. This car is jacked up, too. I'm not gonna lie. I'm surprised that this car is even working. And this music is not really helping. Shit! 
Keep that shit up and Henry's a dead man. Bro, these cars are in my way. What do you want me to do? Gosh. Okay, come on, come on. Like, this car is so busted and beat up. And I got like, oh, he's right there. Okay, good. He's literally right there. Vito there. That house. Park right yeah, in front. I got it. I got it. See, I told you we were going to make it. <sighs> Trying to pressure me. You all Greco the doctor? No. I'm the fucking painter. A friend needs help or he's going to bleed to death. Thanks, Doc. Good God, Henry. Yo, you one. Get him inside. Hello, though. Wait. I got money for you. For the job. What? Take it. You know, this could have waited. But thanks. And hey, thanks for everything. Hope you'll be okay. Yeah. Me too. I'll <sighs> stay here with him. Meet me at my place. <sighs> all right. Okay. Wow, he gave me two thousand dollars. Two thousand dollars. You know what that means? I can finally help my my sister and my mom. Okay, wanted by the police, sorry. I'm gonna go and just casually drive over to my sister's place. Even though this car is so beat up. Unless... Oh, yeah. You know exactly what I'm about to do. You know exactly what I'm about to do. Hold to pick lock. Let's go. Come on. Okay, so... Uh-huh. And... Bingo. Woo! Now! Now who's wanted? Not me. Not this car. I'm good. Now I can get to my sister and mom's house safe and sound with little to no interruption. Oop. Stupid ass car. Oop. Stupid car. Anyways. Yeah, I'm good. I'm doing a nice Sunday drive because it would be so stupid of me to drive a wanted vehicle to my mom's house, you know? I may be a lot of things, but stupid is not in my vocabulary of descriptions. So, I wonder what Vino thinks of this whole gangster lifestyle now. I mean, don't get me wrong, 2G's is nice. And I bet he feels pretty accomplished at the fact that now he's able to help his mom and sister, but... It's still a dangerous job, nonetheless. Pretty risky. And the thing is, if he is starting to kill people, what else are they going to make him do? And how far will he go until he says no? Until they decide to, you know, cap him? We may never know. All right. Mom. Sis. I got the money. Let's go. I wonder what my mom's going to say. Mama. Yo tengo el dinero. Scarletta. Vito, hey, how you doing? Shh, no, 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 no. I just wanted to give you the money to pay off Papa's debt. Oh, yeah. Vito, that's great. I was gonna try and see if we could pay it back in installments. I got a little money. He wouldn't have heard us. Don't be well. so sure, but it doesn't matter now. Here, take Where'd it. you get all this money, Vito? You haven't done nothing you'll be sorry for, have hey, you? Don't worry, everything's fine. It's just Thanks, been working, Vito. that's all. Thank no you. problem. Alright, look, I better be going. I, I don't want Ma to see me. She'll be asking where I got the money, too. Don't worry, I'll make something up. Alright. Give her a big kiss from I me, will. okay? Take care of yourself, Vito. You too. Yes, finally. Now my sis won't have to worry about repaying back the debt. And mom can live comfortably now, knowing that they don't have to deal with that nonsense either. You know, I could have sworn if the spouse accumulates debt and they die, it goes away. Unless, of course, if both spouses decide to sign the loan. But I don't know if that applies to 1940s America, you know? But yeah, 
See, I feel so good and so accomplished now that I was able to help. Yo, I'm not even that far away from my mom's either. Huh. Not bad. Alright, I'm taking this car, so... Uh, let's go. Yeah, I got a new car. And what? After a long day, though, of doing all this craziness, I deserve a good night's sleep. As soon as I get to the apartment, I'm just gonna hit my head on that couch. And go to Dreamland. You ready? Hold on. Where's my... There you go. Right here. Alright, good night. Yo, is that a PI? A private investigator? Or someone who is trying to kill me? Vito Scaletta? Yeah? What's it to you? You're under arrest for the illegal distribution of federal ration stamps. You're coming with us. Great. I've been caught. One of the gas station attendants ratted me out. The guy fingered me and they strung on Mama to telling him where I was staying. Are you kidding me? They had no idea who I was working for and I wasn't about to tell him. What a snitch! I'm just trying to make money. I'm trying to help Henry my mom and sis. a lawyer courtesy of his boss Clementi. I was up Shit's Creek, but at least I had a battle. Could have been a hell of a lot worse if the feds knew and about I any of my other activities. To be even more serious. Considering the fact that you stole national resources at a time when our country needs them the most. And that's the gravity of which you, Mr. Scaletta. The guy was good, but even he couldn't get me out of this one. It was a lost cause from day one. Three months later, they handed down the verdict. Vittorio Antonio Scaletta. For your crimes against the people of this city and of this great country. This court hereby sentences you to 10 years in a federal penitentiary. 10 years for taking stamps? Come on, bro. Are you dead ass? I didn't kill anyone. But I got 10 years. Wow. Going from a war hero to a prisoner. Yeehaw! This is gonna be good. those guys the federal pen thieves murderers child molesters they're all here the worst of the worst all right get in line gentlemen follow me single file and no monkey business or else this is crazy I'm actually going to prison how cute how cute indeed I gotta admit though, this point of view of walking into the prison is actually pretty interesting. You know, my dad went to jail, my mom went to jail, my brother went to jail. Me, never been here. Let's go, so this is basically my close experience. Son of a bitch? Uh, I'm sorry. What's the matter? I can't. speak it in English? Here. No, speak you. the English. Oh my gosh! Wow! This, you sick fuck? Now, get your ass up and get back in line. <laughs> what no. is wrong with? Oh, yo, be these cops! Ass. Don't make me repeat myself. Back in line. Oh my gosh, bro. Yo, this cop is so power hungry. Move oh yeah, in. he he's pissing me off. Bullshit. This whole thing is bullshit, if you ask me. 
Stop right there. Turn to your right. Your other right. Listen up, assholes. My name is Captain Terrence Stone, and this is my prison. You're here on the inside because you can't behave like normal human beings on the outside. Wow, some Make introduction. No mistake. Your ass belongs to me now. My what? You do what I say, or you'll be sorry that you did it. That does fuck not sound with me consensual. And I'll fuck with your sorry ass all day long. Oh my. You were sent here to be rehabilitated and rehabilitate you. This guy has a Hitler mustache. Okay, you assholes. We're gonna and he catch says he's gonna re just long enough to get you cleaned up. What? Now get in line and follow me. They're gonna to shave the my head. You're gonna look just fucking beautiful. Oh my gosh. Hey, me too. I ain't got nothing on my head to cut. Shut your face, cue ball. Well, at least. At least I got a free haircut, right? Didn't need to pay. Okay, let's go. Okay, hey, fine. Shit for brains. Do what you fucking told. Wow, they shaved off my curly little locks. Oh gosh, this is horrible. They didn't even give me a nice shape up, bro. Come on. You're gonna, do what you're told. We're gonna stick you in the hole. Follow me. You're gonna stick me in a what? The hole? Is that solitary confinement you're referring to? Oh my gosh, man. Look at this. This is so creepy. You know what this reminds me of? That one mission in part one where I had to go to the island that had that abandoned prison? Wow. Wow, this is decent. So this is prison, huh? Oh man. I want to go home. I don't even want to be here. This is depressing. I'm this not going to lie. This was going to be my new home for the next 10 years. Look like shit and smell like piss. I would have preferred dodging bullets in Europe to this. After three action-packed days of staring at the wall, I got a message from Joe to contact a guy named Leo Galante, who could supposedly help me out in here. This wasn't the kind of place where you could survive on your own. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.